Madam Speaker, I had the opportunity to be with our resilient troops last week in Afghanistan near the violent southern border with Pakistan. Part of their mission is to secure the border by preventing drugs, arms, money, and Taliban criminals from crossing back and forth through the vast border regions. It's in America's interest to have our military in Afghanistan and protect the sovereignty of that country. It is ironic, however, we see the need to protect the borders of other nations, but because of political reasons, we don't have the moral will to protect our own borders. This is not the first administration that's given a wink and nod to our poorest borders, but it should be the last. Our southern border region is a haven for organized criminal drug cartels, gun smugglers, human smugglers, and rogue outlaws that cross as freely as they did in the days of the Old West. We should be as concerned about protecting our own border as we are about protecting the borders of third world countries like Afghanistan. We should put our military on the border if necessary. After all, the first duty of government is protection of our own homeland. And that's just the way it is. I yield back.